Hi and welcome to The Bots, a channel dedicated to helping you through not only lockdown but real life too. And today I've got a very special message for anyone who's watching who is a mommy. Now we know that moms have got really one of the most difficult jobs in the world. Everybody speaks about it, everybody acknowledges it, but when it comes down to it, how do you really feel as a mom today? How are you feeling going through this lockdown process, this quarantine process? How are you feeling needing to be involved in so many aspects of your children's lives? How do you feel with the increase in involvement? How do you feel with the increased stress? And so for you guys today, I'm going to share a message with you. I'm going to share a bit about my experiences and hopefully this can really help you to acknowledge that you are amazing. When I was growing up, I always looked up to my mom as this, this person with superhuman abilities. I didn't know how she got it all done. I used to think, wow, I ask my mom something and it's done. I, I kind of look around and dinner's done. I, I, I get taken to and from school. I get helped with my homework. And my mom was always there for me to help me through the ridiculous situations and the difficult situations. But I didn't really realize how hectic being a mom was until I had my first child. And when I had my daughter Jubilee, I realized that this is forever. This is the kind of responsibility that you can't just get rid of. This is a forever situation. And this little person is so dependent on every single thing that I as a person do decide not to do all the choices I make and that's a lot of pressure and it really took me a while to get my head around that when I had my son it kind of amplified that pressure because now not only am I providing for one little person, but now I've got to adequately and excellently look after two. And it's such a joy, but it's such a big weight on your shoulders to know that you are responsible for someone. And I'm sure that all of you out there agree with me that day to day, you second guess your decisions. Day to day, you wonder whether what you've done is actually good enough. You struggle with small decisions and large decisions because you want to make sure you're doing what's best for your children. During this lockdown experience, for me, it's become abundantly clear that parenting really is bigger than what a lot of us think it is. The day-to-day -day routines that we put in place now have long-lasting effects. The things that we enjoy with our children now will impact the future. And so we really are legacy builders. And so as a mom, and I'm only talking to moms today, as a mom, you are a legacy builder. Everything you do shapes the lives of people. And that is a big responsibility. And I'm starting to realize more and more that that responsibility is the reason why I always saw my mom as a superhero. Even when things were going, you know, not as expected, when times were really tough, she would knuckle in there, get things done, and make an amazing difference for the people in her own life. So as a mom today, I just want to encourage you. Things are difficult, but you are amazing. Every single day you get a new chance to impart your goodness and your wisdom on your children. And I'm sure that every day you take that challenge seriously and that you invest as much as you can of yourself into your kids. Now, it's no good we just invest everything into our children and we run dry. And so I'm going to remind you that you really need to look after yourself too. Getting that balance right is something that I think most of us struggle with. 
Am I spending too much time with my kids? Not enough time with my kids? Am I allowed to have a career? Am I allowed to have hobbies? Am I allowed to do things without my children? Should I be doing everything with my kids all the time? Or should we have time apart from each other? Now, going through this whole process of being at home more has just made me aware that I am with my kids a lot. I give them everything. But in every day, I need a little bit of time for myself. So doing things like Zoom or online dance classes, going for walks during the time periods we're allowed to walk or runs or cycles, doing some yoga in the garden, whatever it is, those things help refuel you. Another thing that's great is to start your morning with that cup of tea or coffee and a devotion, a journaling time, time just to reflect. And as my kids have gotten older, I've realized more and more that I actually can do that. I can explain to them the older they get, mom just needs a little bit of time just for herself, just to read a book or just to have my cup of coffee. But mom will cuddle you as soon as I'm done. And so finding that balance is going to be different from each and every single one of you. But the balance is something that is attainable. I also want to remind you that you are strong, you are brave, you are courageous. You doctor those wounds when wounds are inflicted. You are there listening and encouraging your children. You are there giving them everything you can. You make sure they have those lunches, those dinners, those breakfasts that are healthy for them. You make sure that they have warm clothes. You give them the best of you. So as we celebrate Mother's Day on Sunday, I want to remind you that you as a mom are amazing. You've done a phenomenal job during homeschool. The quarantine is not over, but neither is your ability to be fantastic. And I want to remind you to look after yourself, just as well as what you're looking after, your precious children. Look after you too. And I just want to thank you for doing such an amazing job and for raising kids as a legacy builder who will one day shape the nations that we live in and change our world for the better. Thank you for being part of that vision. And uh, a big shout out to my own mom, Happy Mother's Day. And to my husband's mom, Happy Mother's Day. We love you and we appreciate you. To everyone out there, have an awesome day. And if you're not a mom, spoil a mom you know who needs a little bit of TLC. Remember to like, to share, to subscribe. Hit the bell down below so that you get notified of new and exciting videos we're going to be uploading and have an awesome day.